Did you know there is a plane in the sky right now designed to keep flying during the end of the world? It's called the Doomsday Plane, officially, the E-4B Nightwatch. To most people, it looks like an ordinary jumbo jet. But inside, it's one of the most secure command centers ever built, designed to survive the unthinkable nuclear war. Born out of Cold War paranoia, the E-4B was created for one terrifying purpose, to ensure that even if Washington was turned to ash, the US government could still launch nuclear retaliation. Unlike Air Force One, the Doomsday Plane is hardened against radiation, electromagnetic pulses, and even shockwaves from nuclear blasts. Its windows are shielded, its electronics reinforced. It carries dozens of military strategists, generals, and technicians, all capable of directing global war from the sky. And it almost never lands. At least one of these planes is always fueled, always ready, circling the skies in secret locations. Unaware, ordinary people gaze up at contrails, never knowing they might be looking at mankind's last insurance policy. In times of crisis, the doomsday plane quietly takes off. On September 11, 2001, one was seen flying over Washington, D.C., a silent sentinel, watching, waiting, preparing for the worst. Its systems are chilling. Inside, military leaders could send launch codes to submarines hidden under the oceans, bombers circling the Arctic, or missile silos buried deep underground. In the event of global nuclear exchange, this plane would become humanity's last nerve center. But here's the haunting question. If the doomsday plane is ever truly used, it means civilization itself is already gone. So the next time you see a jet soaring high above, ask yourself, is it just another flight to nowhere, or is it the shadow of apocalypse, circling endlessly, carrying the keys to mankind's final fire? Because somewhere in the skies tonight, the doomsday plane is waiting for the day we hope never comes.